Grand Risings people, how's everybody's morning going? I hope you're having a good morning so far. Um, I'm doing well, can't complain. Just got this bad backache. I don't know where the hell it's from. I don't know. Um, it may be because I started doing my um, shoulder lifts and my water aerobics. It's like you put your elbows like this on the back of the pool and you lift yourself up. So um, it could be the reason why I'm feeling this way. I don't know. But um, I hope that everybody had a great weekend. I hope that everything worked in your favor the way that you needed to. Again, thank you guys for following me on my Pour It Up Conversations. Also being a part of my Divine Purpose Transformation and, um, you know, journey to my calling. Um, hmm. I don't know. Let's just see what Spirit has to tell you guys today. Um. I do do personal readings in case you guys do need that, just to let you know that it is available to you. Um, and you know, everything will be down at, down below, down below, down below, down below. Um, oh, goodness. Okay. Whew. Yeah. Um, let's see what Spirit has to tell you guys today for the week. For the week. Okay. Feeling this one. Alright, um, <clears throat> way back when, so this is something coming up from way back when, is somebody needing closure from something that happened before, are you guys getting the same repetitive situations, I don't know, we'll see. But it's from way back when. I don't know. I normally don't even look at the bottom of the cards. But you know, I'm, like I tell y'all, I don't, I don't even think I need to be explaining it no more. I just, I'm obedient to what Spirit tells me to do. Um, <coughs> now I ask some questions. Just got choked up. I don't know why. It just got choked up. Well, let's see what's going on here. Mm. Okay. Cover up hidden evidence. So, is it a family secret? Because it says cover up hide evidence. It's a secret. And the first card I saw was way back when. So, oh, my nose is itching. Okay. It's coming up. It's not a dream. The case is closed. You educated yourself through it, so it's something that was hurting you. Um, other people don't want to be bothered by it. And that's their comfort, is not being bothered by it. Mm. Or it's a comfort to not, yeah, a comfort to not be bothered by it. 
So it's something that they buried. It's to cover up evidence. It's a secret. It's case closed. They don't want to talk about it. They don't want to deal with it, but it's so bothering you. It's so bothering you. Mm. It's bothering you. Now I'm feeling like you can't, you feel like you can't move forward without closure to it. And that is, you know, truthful in all cases. Like some people can't move forward without dealing with the issue. Like burying it just makes it resurface. Like they say, what's done in the dark comes to the light. <clears throat> so just burying it doesn't fix it. Because this is going beyond burying it. This is beyond them coaching you. And telling you that it's okay. This is beyond the hurt it all before. Because you want to change paths. You want a new direction. You don't want to feel this way again. You're tired of the hidden agendas. <coughs> you want to see the beauty in life again. And you're indulging in this hurt because you're by yourself. You're by yourself and you're running. And every time you hear this song, it reminds you of it. So this is heartening your heart. It is challenging. It is very challenging. And you just want to return to Cinder. Like you, you want this close. You want this to be unburied. You want this to surface to the top. Because you want the truth to be heard. You know. Because you want a fresh start. You want to start over. You want to start over. And cashing in is you turning in everything. Like you putting everything on the table. You cashing in everything. Because you want to start over. You want to go after your dreams, but you can't because you closed. You closed because other surprises that keep popping up. It keeps it keeps coming back up. Every time you turn around, it's like surprise. It's coming back up, or it's something, or someone does something, and it triggers you to go back into whatever it is that happened that was buried for whatever reason but you know you deserve the world you deserve the world and it's convinced you're convinced that you deserve the world and everything got to go on the flow. They got to go on the flow. You feel like it's water under the bridge. And it says warm. Mm. So warm coming from. Are oh, you that it's warm water that's about to cause a tornado? Oh, it's about to cause a storm. Oh yes. It's warming up. Oh, okay. But however, I don't know. I don't see that it's gonna it's not gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt the people that don't want it to be told. <laughs> That's all it's going to hurt, but you're going to prevail out of it. You're going to prevail out of it. You got to be determined with it. Because when you determine with it, it's automatically automatic. And it's black and white.
when every water turn warm, that rage going to start, and it's it's just automatic. It's inevitable. It's going to happen. It's black and white. It's plain as day. And they keep pushing you over the edge. So you, this is a boiling point. This is the water warming up. It's getting to that point of boiling over because you're tired of it. You are so tired of it. Mm. And you get warning after warning after warning. And you've been telling people and telling people and telling people. And everybody's been just taking it as water under the bridge. But this water that's under the bridge is boiling over in the pot. It's, it's getting to that boiling point. It's getting to that boiling point. Mm. Don't ever allow somebody to get you to that point. Speak your truth. Let the truth be known. After that, if they don't comprehend it or if people don't get it or whatever, then it ain't for them to get. You can't get mad and force people to understand where you're coming from. That's one thing you're going to have to learn. That, um... Everybody ain't going to understand exactly where you're coming from. Ain't nobody going to always agree with what you're saying, you know. And you got to be okay with that. You got to be okay with that. Because you have the gift of choice. Use it. Mm. Ooh, child. Ooh, child, ooh, child, ooh, child. And that could be with a relationship. It could be... Your significant other, they did some stuff, y'all put it underneath the bridge. Well, y'all put it in a box and kept it a secret like they could have stepped out on you and had a mystery child or, um, you know, something of that sort. You know, and it's going to resurface because the, they keep doing the same thing. After you guys agreed to not do it, they keep doing the same thing and it's hurting you. It's hurting you. It's making you ball over. So stop making yourself unhappy just to make somebody else happy. Okay? It could also be for a job. It could be something that's going on in a job and y'all keeping secrets about it. And now it's starting to affect you while it's affecting everybody else because you're reaping what you sold into it. You're reaping whatever it is that you did to help hide the evidence. And now it's resurfacing because... You may have new managers, you may have new people coming in and they're starting to investigate things and now it's starting to ring bells in your ear. Like, you know, like how when people say um, they know somebody's talking about them or something is coming up, they hear it ringing in their ear. You could be going through that too. Um, so whatever it is, you got to get past this because it's pushing you over the edge. It's making you get to a boiling point. Like you about to break. You about to burst. Like you. You got to get yourself together. You got to get yourself together. And like I was saying before, it could also be a family instance. It could be a family situation. And now that the child is getting older, the child is getting ready to know the truth about what y'all been hiding. Mm. It's too much mix upness. Like y'all just take it how it resonate. But um mm. do honey child. Honey do child. <coughs> oh, I see. I see. I see. Y'all just get yourself together, okay? Let the truth be told, because there ain't no better way. There ain't no better way. Living in all of the secrecy and craziness is just... How can you even live like that? Like, I just want to know. Like, I can't. I can't. I, I, don't, I don't know. Like, just... Lying just isn't a part of me. Like, I can tell a little white lie, but I feel bad about it. So it's like, what's the use? Let's see, you see the lie. Like, if I get confronted by something, I just get quiet. I'm just like, I don't know what else to tell you. It is what it is. Deal with it or don't deal with it. I, I don't know what else to tell you. I'm not going to sit up there and stroke your ego to make you feel secure and make you feel better about what I said or how it was done. It was done. It was said. 
next. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Um, but love y'all to life. Y'all have a great day. And I'll talk to you later.